When you fill out the FAFSA, you'll be asked several questions that will determine whether you are an independent or dependent student. This is an important distinction, because if you're a dependent student, then you'll need to include your parents' financial information on your FAFSA. This means that your parents' financial information will be considered along with your information to determine your eligibility for federal student aid. So how do you figure out if you're an independent or dependent student? Generally, if you are a graduate student, on active duty in the U.S. Armed Forces, a veteran, are married, have children whom you support, or are 24 or older, then you are considered an independent student. If you don't meet any of these criteria, then you're likely considered a dependent student and will have to provide your parents' financial information when completing the FAFSA. If you have a different living situation, including divorced parents or living under the care of a grandparent or other relative, the online FAFSA will provide guidance to help you answer the parent questions. In other special circumstances, your status may not be as easy to determine and you'll need guidance from the financial aid office at the college or career school you plan to attend. Some common questions that people often ask are, what if the FAFSA tells me I'm a dependent student, but my parents don't claim me on their taxes or I've moved out of their house and am financially independent? While these situations do arise, they aren't part of the criteria for independent status on the FAFSA so you would still be required to report your parents' financial information on the FAFSA. What if I'm considered a dependent student but have no contact with my parents or access to their information? There are other options available to you in these situations, so it is possible for a dependent student to submit the FAFSA without parental information. If you have indicated on your FAFSA that you cannot contact your parents or access their financial information, you'll need to speak to staff at the financial aid office at the college or career school you plan to attend. The financial aid staff will tell you what to do next. So what if my parents aren't going to help me pay for college and refuse to provide information for my FAFSA? If this is the case, the only federal aid you may be able to receive will be an unsubsidized loan, which is a federal student loan that begins accruing interest as soon as you receive your funds. To find out whether you can get the loan, Fill out your FAFSA and then speak to the financial aid staff at the college or career school that you wish to attend. If you have any other questions regarding financial aid, your college or career school will be able to answer them for you and, if appropriate, make a decision about your dependency status. Their decision is final and cannot be appealed to the U.S. Department of Education. No matter your dependency status, make sure to complete the FAFSA to find out what federal money you can get for college or career school. If you have questions or need more information, please visit studentaid.gov.